j'ai mangé trop de beurre. Je me sens vraiment pas bien, je crois que je vais mon Je mangerai bien un œuf. Les fromages, c'est une catastrophe. Il va falloir des années pour retrier tout ça. Attends, tu trouves pas qu'il y a une vilaine odeur Pas assez haute à mon goût. Je vais attendre la prochaine. Bah, qui c'est cela Eh, hey, dis donc, machin, faut pas rester là, les gars, ok Vous êtes chez nous, donc. Euh, Compris Vous avez entendu quelqu'un parler euh. Dégagez, bande de minus Ah, mais qu'est-ce qu'il y a dans ta bouche qui est mort depuis longtemps Ah, il doit être périmé ce ton, il pue Non, mais pour qui elles se prennent ces crevettes Je vais leur apprendre la vie, moi Il a aussi qu'il Personne ne fera de personne, c'est pas des manières Oui, bah, de toute façon, c'est pas un aquarium ici, ni un marchand de poissons, alors vous dégagez vite fait Tu causes mieux que ça, Blanc-Bec oh. La mer est à tout le monde Alors si tu veux qu'on s'en aille, il va falloir que tu te mesures à mes poulains sur une planche de surf Le perdant, c'est de la plage à l'autre équipe Ouais T'as entendu ce qu'il a dit, petite tête Je vais te pulvériser Tu vas rien comprendre Mais, Demain à l'aube, messieurs, une partie en trois manches Tu es le meilleur gagné C'est ça, vas-y, dégage, espèce de sale poisson qui pue hein. Retourne dans ta boîte, fausse blonde Exactement Et la prochaine fois que je vous vois dans le coin, je préfère vous... Exactement, mon pote Rasmo, il va vous démonter grâce à son bras guitare, notamment. Ouais Bah oui, tu m'as dit que t'étais super fort en surf, alors je... Ah non, smurf Rapido Rapido Rapido, j'ai fait un cauchemar horrible Il y avait des tons énormes au milieu de nos fromages, c'était horrible Et ils étaient tous extrêmement agressifs, et ils avaient des blondes, des rousses Hein La blonde de mes rêves <rire> J'ai pas rêvé, elle me drague là. L'épreuve numéro 1, c'est une figure imposée. Le kamikaze de l'océan. Mmh, mais moi j'ai beaucoup mieux grâce à Rasmo Foufou Surfer. Hey, rapido, euh, je me sens pas très bien. Je crois que je vais aller m'allonger 5 minutes. Rasmo, arrête de nous ridiculiser. Tu surfes sur Internet, alors c'est quoi la différence Bon, alors ça va, on arrête de parler. Les figures à poser. Et c'est à Tony de commencer. Cette figure, très bel enchaînement. Oh, je suis fier de toi. À toi de jouer, mec, tu vas l'éclater. Ouais Vas-y, Raz, ouais, vas-y, montre-leur Oui, oui, c'est pas mal et audacieuse, petit. Mais alors là, je suis désolé, Tony. T'as trouvé ton maître. Avec cette performance, le rat gagne la première manche ou la main. <rire> Aïe, mon don. Vous voyez bien jouer, champion, on les a eus On va fêter ça Oh non, Rapido, tu sais bien que je tiens pas le jus de banane. Bon, allez, 5 coupes maximum, hein Bon, ben, je sais que ça vous coince la rate, mais on va pas en faire un pâté, le rat, il a gagné, puis c'est tout. Ah, oh, Tony Qu'est-ce que tu fais Pourquoi tu fais des trous dans la planche du rat Il va couler ah, mais Je trouve ça joli les trous, c'est comme dans le gruyère, il va en avoir besoin. Et en tout cas, Motus est bouche cousue. Hein. Si tu en parles au coach, je te mets en boîte. Du ton en boîte Épreuve numéro
numéro 2, vous allez faire le saut le plus haut. T'es le meilleur, mon Tony. Alors à vous, maintenant. Ça va pas être facile, vous avez du pain sur la planche. <rire> Mais qu'est-ce que c'est que ces trous dans sa planche ah ah Au secours, je sais pas nager ah Tony, 30 mètres Le rat, 30 cm, ridicule Eh, hey, champion, au cas où tu ne saurais pas le cerf, c'est au-dessus de la bague Et pas en dessous, imbécile <rire> Alors là, bravo, génial, l'humiliation Je crois que je me suis bloqué les lombaires mais oui, la voilà l'idée pour gagner la dernière épreuve Une course de Lambert Troisième et dernière manche L'épreuve de vitesse Les gagnants obtiendront le droit de surfer librement sur la plage Les perdants pourront boucler leur valise et partir en Chine J'espère que vous parlez le chinois, les tons <rire> <rire> Très drôle <rire> Aïe, aïe, aïe T'inquiète pas, pour moi, le ton est déjà dans la boîte. Ton de la boîte. Mais qu'est-ce que je fais de marrant, moi J'en ai marre Sors dehors si t'es un rat On se taille, on m'écoute. Vous démarrez à l'arrière du navire. Ensuite, vous empruntez les passerelles. Jusqu'à la proue. Je vous recommande de faire attention à la marche sur le pont arrière. Bonne chance aux sportifs et que le meilleur gagne. Vous pouvez compter sur moi, monsieur. Ouais, ça, pour finir dans mon sandwich. Et n'oubliez pas les rats. Quand vous aurez perdu, vous abandonnerez le navire. <rire> ouais, c'est ça, ouais. <rire> mais ils devraient être là, mais qu'est-ce qu'ils font Mais qui c'est 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 Ma rat board Et c'est la seule planche que j'ai vu que votre cher petit poulain a fait des trous dans l'autre C'est pas juste... Silence Est-ce que je sache le règlement n'interdit pas les rat board Et leur... Euh... Fait Oh les gars, Tony, c'est pas un ton, c'est une fusée Allez, rapidon, allez <rire> Mais oui, la baignoire <rire> Attention, mon top plouf Top plouf Bravo, tu tiens encore mondial J'ai quand même l'impression qu'il y a de moins en moins d'eau ici, non <rire> Allez, Tony, hop, 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 t'es dans les tours Allez, allez dépêche toi hop, hop. Allez, allez Bravo, chérie. Allez, préparez vos boîtes, vous pouvez partir les sardines. Mais quelle humiliation. Oh, je suis déçu, déçu. Ah oui, on dirait vraiment que je t'ai rien appris, mon Tony. Salut les tons, vous avez de la chance, la mer est d'huile. <rire> Attention, dites ton. Mmh. Ah, bon, voilà. Ça te choque si je te dis que la blonde, elle me fait quelque chose. Tu blagues, j'espère Dis donc, Rapido, j'ai trouvé des photos de ton dans ta chambre. J'espère que c'est pas ce que je pense. Oh, de la pizza, génial Elle vient quoi, celle-là Ton. Comment t'as pu manger Chantal, Rapido Mais tu te rends compte, Chantal, la belle routine, tu me dégoûtes 
Je rigole, c'est du poulet. Je vais quand même pas manger ma belle-sœur. Hazelnuts, we're in the paper! Wow! wow. Mm -hmm. But Maple, this is an article about the reintroduction of wolves in outlying urban areas. Look closer, guys. That's our gym in the background. Yeah! There you go. A nice photo for the Wall of Pride. So cool! I can't believe we're in the newspaper! Such fame! Such what? Fame! Fame? You're not even in the photo! I've still got time to become famous. <laughs> It may happen sooner than you think, buddy. No, oh, huh? is that you? Hmm? Hmm. Look! Hmm? It's him! Ah, it's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I can't believe it. Yeah, no doubt. That's him. He looks smaller in person. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> no! <laughs> he went that way. I saw him. <laughs> He's here. Yeah! What's going on? Two million views in one hour. That's what's going on. Oopsie! I put that on the internet. You filmed me during practice? <laughs> I film you all the time, Daniel. Sisu! Daniel Sisu! I am Daniel Sisu! La 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 la! Yay! <laughs> And boom, viral. Now that's fame. Ah! So millions of people are laughing at me now? They're not laughing at you. They just think you're funny. It's not the same thing. I still want that deleted. <laughs> no! You can't fight destiny. But I don't want to be famous. You already are. And how can you know what you don't want until you know what it's like? <laughs> Look at all these people. Their smiles. Their shining eyes. Their... <sighs> their love. They came here for you. Do you want to disappoint them? <clears throat> Oopsie. Ah, the sound of flash bulbs in the morning. <laughs> What do we do now? We are gonna strike while the iron is hot. My little hazelnut has become a proud hazel tree. <gasps> oh, all this fan mail, it feels so good. Fan drawing. Sponsorship request. Oh, this is big. Look! Daniel! Daniel, Daniel, Daniel! We've been invited to the Golden Universe Ceremony! Wow! That's amazing! Uh, what's that? Who cares? It'll be packed with celebrities! That's perfect! Just in time for my new number! Yeah, you new one now. No, 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 please! Please! Not the balloons! Not the balloons! <laughs> Don't ever do that again, Daniel! Ever! 
I'm not gonna spend my whole life doing oopsies. I want to show people who I really am on the inside. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. You belong to your fans now. Don't you want to make them happy? Huh. Then you gotta give them what they want. Do you know what that means? Mm. Oopsie. Perfect! Let's go. You are gonna bring the house down. Hey, this is unacceptable. I said the guava should not be too ripe. And I asked for blue roses. Hello? Let's get this straight. And I said no wall sockets. I hate wall sockets. And I like my guavas perfectly ripe, not too hard, not too soft. <laughs> yeah, yeah, over here, over huh? here. Here, here. Leopard print, okay? That's how every corner couch should look. <laughs> Can't believe this. Have you seen this, Daniel? Daniel? Five minutes, James. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Came back! Yeah! I'm so happy to see you guys. All right, all right. Give him some space to breathe. So how are you doing, Superstar? Can I play with you? I really miss practice. Daniel, do your thing! <laughs> Oopsie! Yeah! Oopsie! 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 Now say oopsie! <laughs> Mr. Daniel? Coming. <clears throat> Daniel, oh, you were all stressed out. Don't worry about it. Even the pros get stage fright. Hey, let's do some passing drills. That'll loosen you up. What's wrong with you? You've never said no to passing drills. I don't like football much anymore, Erico. It reminds me too much of Oopsie. What? I need to go. The audience is waiting. But if you don't want to play football anymore, I'm gonna be a ball for the rest of my life! Think, Erico. Think! Hmm. Too long. Hmm. Just a bit too big. I'm a genius. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the incredible, the unrivaled, the timeless, Oopsie! <sighs> hmm? Oopsie isn't you, Daniel. Show them who you really are. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Oh! Uh -oh. Your all, buddy. Boo! 
is stuck in his teeth. <laughs> Five million views in two hours. Oh, sorry, Daniel, but you've been upstaged. That's okay. I don't think the celebrity life is for me. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> up the attention, quite literally. We can do better than that. Come on, Daniel, do something funny. Hey, what's wrong with you? Oopsie. And that is why you should never try to ferment your own tofu. All right, kids? What does ferment mean? What does tofu mean? Who's gonna coach us now? <laughs> hey, uh, hazelnuts! Ready to go nuts with Coco the Squirrel? What kind of joke is this? Mom! Whew, they asked me to fill in for Coach Maple. How great is that? Football? My mom? And my ball? Best day ever! Hold on there, Daniel. Mixing business and family is never a good idea. Ever! As your new coach, I'm naming D -D 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 Daniel as our new team captain! Whoa! But he's already captain? Uh, he is? Well, now he can be super captain! All right, Hazelnuts, it's time to do some laps. Ready to set the pace, Super Captain? I've got a bad feeling about this. Ow. Yeah, you're okay? Nothing about this seems weird to you? No. Why? Smoothie? No, not smoothie. Ever since your mom showed up, you haven't moved a finger. How am I supposed to get my body back if you don't train? Hey, that's not fair. I'm training just as hard as everyone else. <laughs> Come on, Hazelnuts! Give it up for your Super Captain! It's me! It's me, Dan! You're the Super Captain! Yeah. Just you wait, Super Captain. Great work today, Hazelnuts. Great work! A great warm-up for tomorrow when we get down to business. Down to business! <sighs> I just can't do this anymore. My knees are killing me. You know whose knees aren't hurting? Daniel. I've never felt so tired in my life. You know who isn't tired? Daniel. Oh no, my battery's dead. You know who doesn't need batteries? Daniel! What's up, Hazelnuts? Are you ready to have fun? Hey, what's the matter? We're on strike. We're not moving until you stop giving Daniel special treatment. Special treatment? Special treatment. What? It's not like he's the coach's pet or anything. Oh, yeah? Then how do you explain the big whistle? Hmm. And the brioche? Hmm. <laughs> They're right, Mom. We're a team. You have to treat me the same as everyone else. Goodbye, Mr. Whistle. <laughs> You're right. I'm sorry. From now on, no more special treatment. Okay? Yeah! You earned your mom! Go, go, go! <laughs> Good job, sweetie. But as you're the last to finish, it's three more laps for you. <laughs> I haven't 
seen a drop of rain in months. <laughs> oh, it's raining. Footballs. <laughs> Rats, who's gonna fetch all those balls? Hmm. <laughs> now that's what I've got, Team Spirit, sweetie. And remember, Mommy loves you! Oh. Don't sweat it. It's part of the process. Look, do you want to be a great football player or what? I think I liked it better when my mom was just my mom. Don't you dare. Your mother is the best thing that ever happened to this team. <sighs> if you say so. Well, I better go polish my pom-poms. Yeah, that's the spirit. Go shine those pom-poms. Wait, what? You know, for the rehearsal tomorrow. Yeah, uh, you mean training. Nah, Mom definitely said rehearsal. I've got to learn all the song and dance moves, too. Five, six, seven, eight. Good grief, how did I miss this? Stay in time together. Five, six, seven, eight. Ready to go nuts with Coco this morrow? Corrine is turning the hazelnuts into mascots, not players. Mascots? Why not referees while you're at it? I knew it. Your mother is the worst thing that ever happened to this team. But you just said... I say a lot of things, okay? Now we gotta ditch your mom and get Maple back. Thanks for stopping by, Daniel. I'm feeling better already. Uh, great. I'll let you get some rest then. He can't hear you anymore. He's only conscious for around 15 seconds per day. So young. Nah, you can never count on Maple. We're gonna need a plan B. Good work, sweetie! One more lap! Was that lap 66 or 67? I've lost count. You know who hasn't lost count? Daniel. I really like this lemonade. You know who doesn't have any lemonade? Daniel. It's such a nice day. You know who's not having a nice day? Daniel. Daniel. <laughs> Mrs. Coco the Squirrel, we think you're being a bit... We think you're being a bit hard on Daniel. Hmm. We feel bad seeing him suffer all alone like this. You're right. From the start, I've been leading this team astray. It's time I took the situation in hand! Five, six, seven, eight! Nuts and hazelnuts, pump those pump Hmm, nasty piece of work, that squirrel. But still, what a woman. <sighs> Your mom sure is a tough nut to crack, huh? Well, this has gone on long enough. You have to tell her to go. What? I can't do that. She's my mom. Can't I just find another team? No, you cannot find another team. Oh, well. Looks like mom's gonna be coaching us forever. I really have to do everything myself around here. Hello? Get me Long Tooth and Knuckle Joe. I have a job for them. Hey, Squirrel. Uh. Came down from your high branch all alone, did ya? Uh. We need to have a little chat. You gotta come back to the team. We need you! Don't worry. All I need is a little more herbal tea, and I'll be wiggling around like a mountain goat in no time. <coughs> it's okay, oh. Daniel. I took care of it. Gee, thanks, Erico! That's great! What do you mean you took care of it? I had a couple of guys come by to convince your mom to resign. <laughs> Relax! Those guys are pros! <laughs> hey! We said not the costume! Go on! Beat it! Whew! It's hot in there. Mom! <laughs> Mom, I was so scared! Don't worry, sweetie. It'll take more than those cowards to stop me from training you guys. Well, about that. 
I think I liked it better when Maple was our coach. I mean, I still love you. I like it better when you're just... Mom. <sighs> Phew. Thank you, Daniel. Football really isn't my thing. We've got to promise each other something, okay? From this moment on, we tell each other what we really think! Yeah! And now... I have to announce my resignation to the team. Daniel, good to see you. Told you the tea would work. <gasps> Yay! Yay! <sighs> All right, ready to train, guys? Goodbye, hazelnuts. Goodbye, Goodbye Coco Squirrel. Okay, guys, I'm leaving. Ah, uh, red light. Goodbye again, hazelnuts. Goodbye, Coco the Squirrel. Ah, green light. See you next time. Okay, back to business. Everyone grab your puppets. It's artistic expression time. Oh, no. Not the puppets. up with a new look. Laundry day. The only thing left was my chic suit. Ha! <laughs> you call that chic? Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Clothes are my thing. You know what they call me? King Drama? Master Red Card? The Backstabber? What? No. My other nickname. Big Chin? No. Style Man, the Prince of Fashion. Okay, we gotta go shopping. Yeah! Uh, I'm not sure about this, Erico. Oh, you look marvelous. Stylish, suave, masculine. <laughs> Makes me want to call you Monsieur. I'm off to work. Mm -hmm. There's some leftover lasagna in the fridge. <gasps> Daniel, what are you doing dressed like that? Are you in a gang? You don't like it? <laughs> mm. This cost a fortune. Where did you get the money for this? <gasps> Don't tell me you're bullying your friends from football and taking their money. What? No way! No, oh, you're turning into a delinquent and it's all my fault. Ever since I took on that third job, we barely see each other anymore. You know what? I'll take the day off when we can go to the movies. All right, sweetie. Uh, Mom... Check it. The new robot combat fighter is out. The explosions are in 3D. <laughs> Sweet dreams in 2D, honey. Mm. Good night, Mom. Yeah! yeah! Best day ever! ever! And all because your mom thinks you're going astray. <laughs> <laughs> Me, a gangster. <laughs> mm, are you thinking what I'm thinking, Daniel? Hmm. Didn't you want to go to the carnival? No, Erico. Lying to Mom is wrong. Daniel, what were you thinking? I don't know what's gotten into him recently. It seems pretty clear to me. A kid needs his mom. Take him to the carnival or go-karting. Or out for a meal. Oh, Chinese would be great. <sighs> what am I going to do with you, Daniel Sisu? <sighs> okay, grab your coat. We're going out to dinner. <laughs> Daniel, I'm getting really worried about you. You're not just doing this so we spend more time together, are you? <laughs> no, no! I don't know why. I just can't keep out of trouble. <sighs> I got mixed up in some bad stuff when I was your age, too. 
Believe me, it's not worth it. So, time to toe the line, okay, honey? I promise, Mom. Mm -hmm. Good night, bad boy. Are you a deep sea diving or winter sports kind of guy? Winter sports? Deep sea diving. Deep sea diving. Winter sports? No, Erico, it's over now. You don't mean that. Your mom's so close to taking us on vacation. I don't want to lie to her anymore. My thug life is over. Okay, Daniel. You leave me no choice. Time to get up, sleepyhead. Breakfast is ready. <gasps> What's the problem? Daniel, tropical paradise, here we come! What did you do this for? And where did you get all this money? Relax, it's all fake. The armored truck, the cash, even the <laughs> Italian shoes. Hmm? <gasps> uh. Okay, Daniel, I get it. This is the life you want, and there's nothing I can do to change that. But I'm still your mother! If you can't help but become a criminal, we'll do it together as a family. Come on, get in. Mom, I don't think this is such a good idea. The Sisu crew is in the... Buckle up, honey. The Sisu crew is in the house. <laughs> you okay, Daniel? Still up for the thug life? <laughs> You just wait here for a second, okay, sweetie? Mama's gonna rub a bank. She's bluffing. You don't really buy her gangster act, do ya? She's not gonna do it. Huh? Oh, that's my money! Oh, oh no. no! She, she did, did it! it. Yeah, uh, how old's your mom? 30-something. Yes, a 30-something woman, short hair, the car has flames on the side, come quick. Hey! You can't tell on her, she's my mom! Yeah. <laughs> I know a guy. Yeah, right, I know. It's been quite a while. Your mom's gone crazy, Daniel! Tell her the truth! But then she'll know I lied! Who cares? This has gone too far! Tell her! <laughs> you okay, Daniel? Nothing to tell me? Uh, uh -uh. Okay, off we go. The mountain is waiting for us. Are we going skiing? <laughs> <laughs> no. The mountain is the most wanted criminal in the city. Things go bad, just run and don't look back. Got it? I can't leave her alone! <laughs> nope, stay here, Daniel. That guy looks really dangerous! You got the cash? I gotta help my mom! It's too late for that, Daniel! Let go of the bag! We can still make it out of here if we get rid of it! 
No bag, no evidence, no problem! <laughs> You're under arrest! <laughs> the mountain's a cop! We gotta move it, fast! <laughs> Nothing to tell me, Daniel. As you wish. I made it all up to you and spent time with me. I'm sorry I lied. Daniel Sisu, promise me you'll never lie to me again. I promise, Bobby. Please, get out of the vehicle with your hands up. I don't want to go to jail! <laughs> Mom's in trouble with the cops, and it's all because of us. <sighs> Bobby! It's all good, boys. I think he got it. <laughs> <laughs> What? Dirty laundry? I don't believe you've met my friends from the drama club. We're saved! I want this room spotless by the time I get back. I'm counting on you, Daniel. Mom really got us good, didn't she? I was so scared, weren't you? Flitzana doesn't know fear. I left it in the locker room a long time ago. Oh, hey! You're under arrest! Don't shoot! I'm famous! <laughs> yeah, very funny, Daniel. Whoa! Erico, what's that? This, Daniel, is 70 pounds of pure love. Fan mail is just the best. I remember when I used to write you lots of fan mail. <laughs> but you didn't even open them! What? Next you'll expect me to read them? <laughs> ah, Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Breaking news. Direct from Villa Platana, an incredible press conference is happening. What? That striking nose. That profile of a Greek god. That's me! <gasps> Mr. Plutana, why these months of silence? Where have you been all this time? Do you prefer cereal or toast for breakfast? I have an announcement to make. I have decided to stop playing professional football. What? Who is this guy? I mean, he's gorgeous, but what's he talking about? He has your hair. He's in my villa! And your huge chin. Let's go, Daniel. We're gonna have a word with this phony. As soon as he opens the door, boom! You just go for it. Hello? I'm Daniel Sisu, Erico Platana's biggest fan. Hello, Daniel. It's a pleasure to meet you. Likewise. <laughs> no, I mean, you're not the real Erico. You're an imposter! <gasps> I knew this day would come. You're right, Daniel. I'm not the real Erico. I'm a professional identity thief. Professional? Puh, get over yourself. I get plastic surgery to steal the identities of influential people so I can try to make the world a better place. A better place. Selling Erico's submarine let me open a foundation to save the bees. What? My submarine? <laughs> you know that bees make honey, right? Yum. Honey. Selling his private island let me send books to thousands of children. Oh no, my private island. Books for children. You know, Daniel, for these kids, books are like windows to the world through which they can escape. Escape. Oh, yeah. How am I supposed to escape without a submarine or a private island? But now that you found me out, it's time to put an end to it all. It was a pleasure meeting you, Daniel. Here, a honeypot and a book for a little guy that's one of a kind.
See you in another life. That's right, pretty boy. Don't let the door hit you on your way out! Wait! Mm -hmm. What was that about? Sorry, Erico. I know it's hard to resist that ravishing smile, but there's only one Erico Platana, and that's me! But he's such a nice guy. Mr. Imposter, I wanted to tell you... Here you go, Daniel. I made you some hot chocolate. <laughs> tell me what you think of this free hugs project. What on earth is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> and if everyone opened their piggy banks, no one would be poor anymore. We're gonna start a bust out your piggy bank operation. This is absolute genius, Daniel. Ah, uh, it's no big deal. You know, Daniel, it's the no big deals that can change the world. Psst. Mr. Imposter. I really need to tell you something. One sec, Daniel. What are you doing? I just came up with the rhyme I was looking for. That should bring a smile to little Marion's face. Hmm. You're answering all of Eriko's fan mail? With rhymes? She sent me a poem. I couldn't just leave it without an answer. Ah. Uh. You won't believe this! Mr. Irresistible changed my whole dressing room! Ha! This guy! Erico, I have to tell you! Ah! This turquoise does bring out the color of my eyes. <laughs> Erico, I don't want him to go! I told him to stay! What? I know he's not the real you, but he's nice to your fans! He's saving the world! And his hot chocolate is delicious! This guy is stealing my life, Daniel! But you don't need it right now. You're a bull. <laughs> okay, Daniel. I see whose side you're on. Hey! Erico, I'm locked in! Erico! Now it's just you and me, you handsome sham. Combat drone, great white shark. Combat drone, great white shark. <laughs> How can you say no to those eyes? Huh? Hmm. Such a perfect body. You okay, Mr. Imposter? A great white shark. That's an endangered species. Poor thing. I'll call a marine biologist friend of mine. Erico, what have you done? I couldn't, Daniel. I love myself too much to hurt him. He wins. Huh? Erico? Stole everything from me! Dirty thief. Good looking, crook! Erico? Oh, you reek of pineapple juice! I thought you hated that. Oh, what do you care? I'll drink whatever I want. And the nicest guy of the year is... Erico Platana! You should be happy. Everyone is talking about you. You've even been nominated for a Nobel Peace Prize. Who cares? Some guy's sleeping in my bed and wearing my shirts. But the whole world loves you. You've never been so popular. It's not me they love, it's him. You know what, Daniel? He's a better Erico than I'll ever be. <laughs> you were right, Daniel. Since we sent kittens to all the world leaders, wars are down by 43%. <sighs> 
we add a ball of yarn, we could make that 50%. What's wrong, Daniel? Mm. I'm glad we're making the world a better place. But I think this is unfair to the real Eriko. I understand. But think of all the things we've accomplished! I know, but the real Eriko might be incredibly sad that you've stolen his identity. And spent all his money. That's true. Even the best intentions don't excuse everything. It's your call, Daniel. Just say the word and we'll stop. I think it's time we gave Eriko his life back. It's been a real pleasure, Daniel. I'll go get my bag. For my things! Erico Platana is finished! Don't worry, you can have your life back! I fixed everything! <laughs> no, you didn't. I did. Boom! No more Platana, no more anything. Oh no! Erico, what did you do? I called a combat drone. Boom! I'd rather blow everything up than let that very gorgeous phony touch my stuff. But he's gone now! You can have your villa, your name, and your life back! Huh? For real? He may be nicer and more patient than you, and more generous. And his hot chocolate is heavenly. Did you forget about the combat drone? Okay, okay. What I mean is that you too can become a better person. You just need the chance. <laughs> Facial recognition. No face detected. No face detected. Uh -oh. yeah! There it go! Thanks. It's okay, Daniel. I'm fine. I guess this is where we part ways. Time for me to find a new face. Oh. Yeah, that's right! Good riddance! Beautiful back definition, though. And don't forget, Thomas, you don't need to win to know you're the best. Kind wishes, Erigo Platana. Okay, we done? Just one more, Erigo. It's for a certain. <laughs> oh, wow! Tell me about that one! Again? You know that story by heart. Oh, come on, please! Oh, fine, okay. <clears throat> In 2011, Platana's hairstyle not only shocked millions of spectators, it also completely reinvented Mohawk Sideburns. Mohawk Sideburns? Hmm. You know, speaking of hairstyles, Daniel, it's about time we take care of yours. Really? But, uh, Mom is the one who cuts my hair. Oh, Daniel, Daniel. Don't you think the greatest football player on the planet would also be the greatest hairstylist on the planet? Hmm? Uh, okay. Oh, I knew you'd come to your senses. So, given the shape of your head, we're gonna have to be a little creative. Hmm. <sighs> Good morning, world. Good morning, my little kettle. Good morning, my little squashes. <clears throat> Good morning, my lower back. Good morning, my little cup. Get up, get up. Get up, get up. Oh, 3 p.m. already? Time to get ready for practice. Good afternoon, my little hazelnuts. Say, where's Daniel?
<laughs> Sisu, you look like a kneecap that tried to grow a beard. <laughs> <laughs> you look like an old fogey trying to look younger. <laughs> you know who you look like? You look exactly like... Oh. <laughs> today's today's practice is canceled. I'm just not fitting up to it. <laughs> Maple, I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to make fun of you. <laughs> Nice work, Sisu. Now Maple will never want to coach us again. He always tied my laces for me. <laughs> he always made the coolest cupcakes. Where are we gonna get a new coach now? <laughs> when they assigned this team to me, everyone said it was a lost cause. Who are you? Boy, were they ever wrong. You guys stink, but that's about to change. I'm gonna turn you into champions. <laughs> Any questions? Uh... You're off the team! Everyone else, 10 laps. <laughs> uh, are you sure you know what you're doing, Eriko? Uh, you've never coached a team before. Daniel, shh, Daniel. Has it ever occurred to you that the greatest football player and hairstylist on the planet would also be a champion coach? Uh, is champion coach a thing? Hey! Don't think I can't see you dragging your feet! I'm gonna sculpt your pudgy little bodies into winning machines! Thirsty? A real champion licks the dew off the field! You're off the team! <laughs> hey, what's this? Uh, You're off the team! <laughs> Maya, what do you think of the new coach? She's an insecure tyrant who will drive us into utter chaos and disaster. Maya, is that Velcro laces I see on your shoes? You're off the team! Have fun with that! That's enough! Eriko, we need to talk. You're off the team! Oh, it's you. Sorry, Daniel. Uh, so, what's up? You can't just get rid of everyone. I'm the only one left! Ah, uh, no. There's still, um, uh, Steven? <laughs> You're off the team! Oh, well, uh... If they don't have what it takes, we'll just buy better players. Is that it? I told you we had no money. No one is that broke. Maple must have stashed some cash somewhere. So what do we have here? Nothing. 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 Oh, there has to be something. How can somebody be this broke? Seriously. <sighs> Erica, wait! We need to get the hazelnuts to come back. What? Never. Changing your mind makes you look weak. We need them. Trust me. It's never too late to put the pieces back together. Now we can get back to practice.
No, Erico! You might be the greatest football player in the world, but Maple is a better coach than you! Are you kidding? Maybe one day you'll be a great coach, but right now we need to find Maple. Hey, hey, good morning, world. Watch up, hot chat. Nice dive. Hey, Hansel. Hop back at you. Hiya, Sylvia. How you doing? Hey. What's the best way to make a small fortune in the stock market? Start off with a big fortune. <laughs> <laughs> good one, Patrick. Good one. Bye, bye. Sell, sell! Bye, for goodness sake! Maple, hmm? you hear? Wow, Maple! Daniel? We're sorry about everything. Is everything okay, Michael? Children aren't allowed on the sales floor. Everything's fine, Jane. I've got it under control. We're sorry about everything, Maple. That's not my name anymore, Daniel. I've left that life behind me. And here we go! We're really sorry, Maple! Really, really sorry! <laughs> Is everything okay, Michael? We failed! Maple isn't coming back. No more hazelnuts. No more, no more hazelnuts. Bye. Hmm? Aww. Guys? What up? Maple? I'll never abandon you again. <laughs> the program today is... Meditation and Tribal Percussion. Yay! <laughs> well, my work here is done. I'm leaving. Wait, 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 wait. Don't I get a song? <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Coach. We sure had fun, but now, now it's, it's done. done. Now it's done! Yeah. Make me proud, kids. And don't forget, never give away my autograph for free. Time. Every time we practice, it's always the same. Come on, guys! We can do this! We haven't scored a single goal in the whole tournament. We couldn't even beat the Pee-wee team. <laughs> but they were so cute! We're never gonna win a game. <sighs> Thanks for trying, Daniel. Hey, see you guys back here tomorrow, right? Who 
Who's the best? No ifs or buts. We are, we are hazelnuts. Wow, are they lame or what? They are not lame. All they need is a little hope. Here we go. I have written an awesome speech to motivate the team. Hey, that was one of my top ten goals of all time. <clears throat> my fellow hazelnuts. My fellow hazelnuts, my mom always says you have to believe in your dreams. That's why I want to... <coughs> I want to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Big money, big cars, big watches, and big money. That's how you motivate a team. That's not the only way. Self-confidence is really important too, you know. Also, we don't have any money. Aww. Okay, forget it. For starters, you guys need to stop thinking like losers. We're doing our best! Said like a true loser. Trust me, Daniel, it's time for a little action. You sure this isn't cheating? What are you talking about? You can't cheat at practice. That's not even a real game. of you, Hazelnuts. <laughs> awesome, Eriko! Our plan worked! That's nothing. Fasten your seatbelts, people. The Platana machine is ready to rock! <laughs> My little hazelnuts have blossomed into solid oak trees. Come on, you guys! Now let's get back to practice! Pfft, what for? Yeah, with skills like these, who needs practice? Let's go see a movie. Yeah! Eriko, I think we made a big boo-boo. Nah, they're super confident now. I mean, that's exactly what you wanted, right? Hey, our new theme song. Ozzernut, Ozzy, Ozzy, Ozzernut, dance team around. Ozzernut, Ozzy, Ozzy, Ozzernut, you can ditch this. Awesome, right? Isn't it a bit, uh, aggressive? Ooh, first comment. The Crushers? They're the most brutal team in the league! Those girls have sent all their opponents to the hospital! Those girls? Don't tell me you're scared of a girls team. So, you guys are the best around, huh? <laughs> Tomorrow, North Turf. Go! <laughs> Step on it, Daniel. The next plane to Punta Cana leaves in an hour. We can't let our friends down. We have to save them. Uh, didn't you guys see the video comment? Oh, chill. It's all good. We'll eat those crushers for breakfast. For breakfast! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we've made a lot of progress, but, uh, we're not ready to take on the Crushers yet. What's with all the loser talk, Sisu? Yeah, you're kind of bringing us down. Bad vibes, Daniel. Very bad vibes, man. Uh... Who else thinks Daniel's being a party pooper, hmm? Uh... Thanks a lot, Daniel. I barely got to the food table. We're doomed, Erico! We're all gonna end up in the hospital! The hospital! We don't have a choice. We have to tell them the truth. What? You mean the whole truth? Everything. That you're Erico Platana. That you've been turned into a ball. That we cheated at practice! 
no one can know that the great Eriko Platana has turned into a ball. Sorry, Eriko, but the team always comes first. This is too important. Wait, 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 wait. I know. <laughs> Tell him you're, uh, the... Uh, the ball charmer. <laughs> no one's gonna believe a dumb story like that, Eriko. Hey, everyone, listen up! Oh. Come back to Earth. Yeah, you think we'd believe a dumb story like that? <sighs> okay, but I did rig the training session. I'm a ball charmer. But if you're the one who controlled the ball, we're dead meat. Which one of you pipsqueaks is the team captain? Mm. May the best team win. Well, have fun, kids. And don't forget, you're stronger when you stick together. Good luck. Hmm. Fellow hazelnuts, my mom always says you have to believe in your dreams. That's why I want everyone to think very hard about victory. Are we good? No. Will we all come out of this alive? Maybe not. Have we lost every last one of our games? Absolutely! But today, we're going to be victorious, my friends! You know why? Because we never, ever give up! Come on, Hazelnuts! Let's go! Wait, couldn't you just play the flute instead? Captain. It was beautiful, Daniel. Come on. Pick up your flute. Play for your team. Play for victory! <laughs> <laughs> the flute! Yes! So happy. 